Something interesting about me is that prior to coming to medical school, I actually had a career in uh, special education. I taught sixth and seventh grade in the Bronx for three years. And then since coming to medical school, I've been really lucky that I've been able to continue pursuing my passions for teaching and leadership. I think one of my favorite things I've done since I've been here is being able to serve as the president of my class. And that's really allowed me not only to engage the students and the faculty, but kind of get a taste of leadership at the national level. I was able to participate in the AOA House of Delegates. I was able to travel to Washington, D.C. for DO Day on the Hill, which was really exciting. I think the thing I'm most proud of, though, of all the things I've done is that I'm actually a member of the United States Navy. And through that, I was very fortunate to match into a categorical general surgery position here in my hometown in San Diego at Naval Medical Center San Diego. After my six year residency, I'm looking to do a fellowship in trauma surgery and I'm really excited about it. And I think that when I think about osteopathic medicine, um, it's really near and dear to my heart, particularly because it saved my ability to be a surgeon. My second year of medical school, I had a really unfortunate accident, a dog attack um, that left me really unable to use my right hand for several months. And it was only through the work of an osteopathic physician practicing OMT on my hand that allowed me to gain full function and continue pursuing this dream of mine. So I'm really optimistic about what I can offer my future patients in terms of healing both their pain um, as well as bringing them, you know, comfort to their mind, body, and spirit.